Hello students, how are you? Hope you are doing well. Now the question is, plot a graph showing the variation of current with voltage for the material gallium arsenide GaAs. On the graph, mark the region where resistance is negative, part A, and part B, Ohm's law is obeyed. So the question is based on the graph between voltage and current for a particular type of material which is gallium arsenide. First of all, gallium arsenide is a kind of a compound semiconductor. This is a compound semiconductor. Compound semiconductor means it has gallium and arsenic as two different elements combined in a manner. Uh, opposite to it, there are certain pure intrinsic semiconductors such as silicon and germanium. So, this is a different category kind of material. So, for this particular material, if we plot the graph, if we plot the graph between the current and voltage, let us take the current as the y-axis and voltage as the x-axis. Then the graph between current and voltage looks like this. This is the graph between current and voltage. Current is at the y-axis and voltage is at the x-axis voltage is at the x-axis so you can clearly see that there is a particular region where when the voltage is increasing the current is decreasing the current goes down for example let us take this point as a and this point as b so between a to b from going a to b the current is decreasing whereas the voltage is increasing <clears throat> and we know that the resistance is equal to v upon i so we can say that i is decreasing whereas v is increasing in this way we can say that resistance is negative in this particular region so this region this particular region we have to mark this region as the negative resistance region this is the negative resistance region this is the answer of the first part this is the region for the first part for the second part ohm's law is obeyed for which region the ohm's law is obeyed now ohm's law states that v equals to v equals to i r so v equals to i r is the ohm's law statements of the ohm law in the ohm's law it is important that the resistance is positive positive in the sense that when the voltage is increasing the current is also increasing then we can say that the resistance is positive so this particular region for example this is point o from o to a the region is the positive resistance region or we call this as the ohmic region this is known as the ohmic region or the region where ohm's law is obeyed so this is the answer of the first part, second part, that is B part, and this region corresponds to the region of the A part. So we have to mark these two regions in this particular problem and make the graph between current and voltage. So this is the particular answer of this particular problem. So hope you understand the solution. Thank you.